I'm going to sh show everybody uh, this furry and uh, S system that's uh, installed on my uh, Jayco fifth wheel. All right, so here I am at the camper now. We just hooked up. We're getting ready to go camping, like I said. And here are the turn signal with the camera. And like I said, I'm going to show you what it looks like on the road uh, once we get in there. You see the lights are on. That's one of the things that you need to make sure. You need to make sure your headlights are not on automatic. Because I thought I had a problem with the uh, with the Furion because they come on and off. But uh, I'm just checking the lights too. But right up there, there it is. And I think I think our camper's 35 feet, and we have no problem with the signal. So um, that's lights working. That lights working. Just checking everything out, making sure everything's on the side markers. And here is the passenger side. So, um, as you can tell, they go on just like a regular side light. And the one in the back just mounts to the uh, adapter that came with the Jayco. So, um, there you go. All right, and there's the, uh, the camera and you can hit it and then you can go left side that's what's coming out my left camera, the right side, and just the rear. And then I think there's some way where you can put all of them on. There you go. That's not right. Come on. I know you want to. There we go. So that's the back, left, and right. Pretty cool. Um, I think I got the five inch screen, but uh, seven inch screen would probably be more helpful and when i'm going down the road i usually just use the rear because that way i know if i'm passing somebody if i'm clear or not so um there you go hopefully this helps you decide if you decide you want to get a uh full-fledged system for your rv or fifth wheel